What's up guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Liz Weber. If you're new here, we are starting a fresh new series. We are starting a vlog series. I'm a first time mom and so I decided, you know what, we're gonna vlog our day to day because I do like mini vlogs over on TikTok and on Instagram, definitely go follow along over there. I thought it could be fun to do some like more long form videos. Um, it's funny, we were filming this morning and Zach was like, I feel like we're just filming family videos but you're gonna put them on YouTube. I'm like, it's exactly what's happening. Today I thought would be a good day to start because we are going to the lake with her. We are going to a brewery. We are having some friends over. We have a pretty packed Saturday. So I thought it could be fun to take you guys along with us and just like see how our day to day goes. Um, this is a typical weekend for us. We do have some friends that have a lake house. So we're gonna go up there today and then hit up our favorite brewery spot on the way home. And then one of our other favorite things to do is to grill out. We absolutely love hosting. We moved into this new house back in September. We love having people here and just sharing memories with our friends here in this house. So anyways, I have not gotten ready yet. Haven't done my makeup, clearly haven't done my hair. I feel like I look like a thumb over here, but we are going to get like lake day ready today. Um, so I did put on, I don't have it down here with me, but I did put on the Super Goop Glow Screen. It has like a little bit of a tint and that way I have my sunscreen on. And then we're gonna do like a little bit of a light makeup look and then go get Emmy. You're probably wondering, where's my child? She is still sleeping, which is amazing because this girl was going through and still probably is going through a four month sleep regression. I will have to do a whole video on our sleep journey because she started sleeping through the night around six weeks for like 10 hours straight for seven weeks. So from six weeks to 13 weeks, she was sleeping seven hours straight. It was amazing. But then the four month sleep regression kind of, you know, hit us a little bit early around the three month mark. And she woke up, you know, like every couple hours and still is kind of doing that. But we have a sleep coach and she basically told us that we need to be putting her down awake to make sure that she is able to sleep independently. So when she wakes up in the middle of the night, she can put herself back down. Totally makes sense. So we started doing that yesterday for the very first time. And she literally put herself down like the first time. Zach and I were just like, Bravo, our child is a genius. You know, every parent thinks that. But we really were so proud. I was like, you're so independent. And then she only woke up once last night. Normally we're used to her waking up like three times. So anyways, let's get ready for the day and I'll take you along our Saturday with us. Got that slick back that? bun. <laughs> like what? I look like Where's a thumb. Hair? I don't know. It's honestly all falling out. That's where it is. I just have to keep pivoting and walking around like I'm doing something, but really I'm just pacing the room. Wait guys, we did a full reset last night of our house. And so we came downstairs and we were just like, oh wait, this is nice. Like everything's all clean. It's the best feeling. We do need to flush the couch still, but everything looks really nice. It just feels so nice and clean down here. And Emmy is still sleeping. I'll do more on this, but she was going to do the full This is cute. Happened. This, you, this is funny. We've been doing this for seven minutes. <laughs> she looks like she's stirring a little bit. She also is sleeping for the first time with her arms out, and I think she loves it. Like, she loves being able to just, like, sprawl out. So, yeah, like, mother, like, daughter, I love that, too. If you follow me over on any other social media platforms, you probably see me just freaking freak out about this sports bra. I wear it every single day if I can. It is the best. Okay, not every single day, because that'd be gross. I wear this sports bra all the time. If you're gonna be a new mom, like this is a must have, like put it on your registry. Can you put Lululemon on your registry? It just literally feels like a cloud and I'm obsessed with it. Also, I don't own, well I do, but I don't use any nursing bras. I just like pull this down to feed her. It might be TMI, but if you're gonna be a new mom, maybe try that before like investing in the expensive nursing bras. I just pull things down or pull things up. It's super easy. Somebody's awake. This is Everson. <laughs> Look at how cute she is. She woke up, I just fed her, and now I'm about to change her. Give her a little diaper change and then also a little outfit change for the lake day today. We're gonna play on her little mat that's right behind me. We have the Love Every Play mat, and she loves it. She's so engaged with it, which is really cool. It's been cool watching her like learn how to interact with all the, the different little things on there. So she's gonna play on that while I get ready. She loves this little thing. She'll like chill on it. She'll like kind of roll onto her side. She hasn't fully rolled yet, but she'll roll onto her side and just kind of play with this little bell thing. 
it's awesome. Also our little setup. So down here, this is my office. And what I have down here is I have her play mat. I have the baby arm bouncer. So that way sometimes I'll bounce her while I get ready or work. And then we used to have the pack and play up against this window, but it was just kind of bulky down here. So instead we have this little like travel um, changing pad. It's super cute, like black and white stripe. I take this with us sometimes if we're like going somewhere for a long time, like we might take it today to the lake. But I just change her on that every day. That's like our changing situation downstairs. Here's what the hair looks like down. Um, yeah, so I guess the rest of the morning, it's only like 9 a.m. So she's gonna go down for a nap around 9.30. I'm gonna pack our bags and everything for the lake and just kind of start getting things prepped so that way, whenever she wakes up from her nap, we can, we can go to the lake. I'm making you a little bacon, egg, and cheese with avocado, mayo, and hot sauce. Yum. And tomato. To be completely honest with you guys, I don't make any of the food in this house. Zach, <laughs> that is pretty true. You cut fruit for me. I cut fruit. Yeah, I know, for real though, he makes most of the food. I'm very thankful. So we actually have not announced this yet, but Zach and I actually booked a place on the Upper East Side to stay, so in New York, to stay for an entire month um, starting in September. So we'll be gone September 10th through October 15th with Emmy in a three bedroom apartment in the Upper East Side. We are so excited. So I'm actually right now um, putting together some like outfits. Um, I am use Canva to kind of just like piece together things because I'm obviously going to have to be very particular about what I bring. So I'm trying to kind of like narrow it down to the basics um, and some things in my closet that I love and I know I'll be able to wear multiple times. So yeah, I, we're so excited. Like it doesn't feel real. I got to figure out travel stuff with Emmy too, but we're so pumped. This is just like a small portion of what we are bringing to the lake. We're actually going to bring her Docatot and this thing has like a little cabana to go over it to help her like be protected from the sun. So we'll have that over it. I had a it's little so campaign to shoot here on the dock. So we got Mr. Photographer out here. Sunday morning hangouts. We're making brunch here at the house. Golf is on. It's the same thing that we made in the last video that she was talking about breakfast. <laughs> Smiling, smiling. Yeah, she was. Yeah, she's just smiling. Are you having a smile? Yes. We stayed up until like 2 a.m. last night talking with our friends here at the house, um, which was so dumb because we should have definitely been sleeping while Amy was sleeping. Um, but today is just a nap day, a chill Sunday. Maybe I'll get a workout in, but it's just really a chill day and just getting Emmy down for naps too. Working on the new sleep method and it's actually going pretty well. Um, her naps have been pretty short, but we're kind of like working on those today too. This couch is the ultimate nap couch. We got golf on, which is perfect for napping for me as well, because definitely fall asleep through that. But this is just the best nap couch ever. All right, so I did decide to go to the gym. I feel like I need to move my body. I feel like I haven't really worked out in a couple days. So we do have a home gym, but I kind of like going to the gym. I feel a little bit more motivated. It's nice to kind of switch it up. And Emmy is napping right now, so kind of hoping that she naps until I get back. We'll probably do a little dinner at home tonight and then just kind of like chill the rest of the day after I get home from working out. And then I have a YouTube video I'm editing. It's like a baby registry must have. So I'm gonna work on that tonight too. And then maybe, maybe I'll edit this too. All right, guys, I got a pretty good workout, and I think I'm going to end this weekend in my life vlog here. Um, whew, 
hair is hair is crazy so guys thank you so much for watching this weekend in my life vlog it means so much to me that you're here supporting this channel and just my content in general um i absolutely love what i do i do do this full time so i just appreciate it and i would absolutely love it if you would like and subscribe that would just mean the world to me every single time i see a new subscriber i just get so excited so that would mean the world if you enjoyed this content there's so much more to come um i think i mentioned earlier that we are moving to new york for a month in september so we're going to be doing daily vlogs while we are out there which i I'm just stoked about so I'm gonna be doing a lot more vlogs kind of leading up to that showing you guys how we're packing how we're prepping um, and just everyday life so again thanks so much for joining and I will see you guys on the next one bye